everybody, Lurgs here. Welcome to my channel. I'm here to save you time and money. And today it's how to fix a loose toilet handle. Right, let's get cracking. This is our toilet here and this is the flush handle on the right hand side. And if I just take hold of it, you can see it's pretty loose. Now if you actually flush the toilet, it still does actually flush. But this is not very good when it's all loose so we just need to tighten it up now the first thing you need to do is just remove the cistern lid and i'm going to be quite careful with this because it's china and here we are inside the toilet cistern if we look at the back of the handle here we've got this plastic locking nut and that is what we tighten up to make sure that the handle doesn't move around too much now what you're doing is you're tightening this up clockwise but as you're facing it so as if you're at the back and looking inwards so tighten it up with your fingers and your thumb and just tighten it up as much as you can if your actual flush lever mechanism is broken there's a link above now about how to replace the whole handle mechanism on this toilet So that's as tight as I can get it with my fingers. What I'm going to do now is just take a spanner and just tighten it very, very gently. I'm not going to go mad with this, just maybe half a turn, just so it locks it into place. Whatever you do, don't over tighten it because obviously it's plastic threads and you'll damage it. And there's a link above now about how to clean your UPVC window frames so they stay clean. Right, I'm happy with that. The handle is now a lot tighter and now I'm going to sort out that rusty locking screw. Now look at this screw. I can't believe I've replaced this handle about a year ago and already that locking nut screw has gone all rusty. So what I'm going to do is just remove it and then put a bit of Vaseline on it just to stop it rusting away. So I'm just going to remove this quickly. Whilst I'm doing that, there's a link above now about how to stop your dripping stopcock. So I'm just going to dip this in the tub of Vaseline. Don't worry, this isn't the Vaseline from the medical cabinet. <laughs> this is Vaseline that I use in the garage for various DIY jobs. Now I'm just going to screw it back in here. Always do it with your fingers first. because You don't want to cross thread it. Once it's in there pretty decent, then get your screwdriver back out and just tighten it up. And hopefully this will just stop it going a bit rustier. Whilst I'm doing that, there's a link above now about what to do if your washing machine is not draining water. Okay, I'm happy with that. Now we can put the system lid back on. And it's definitely made me quite thirsty. So, oh! I think I'm going to have a cup of tea. And after all that hard work, it's time for a lovely cup of tea. Oh. Oh. And then it's time to check that the toilet handle actually works. A bit of privacy, please. If you found that video useful, please subscribe by pressing this button down here so you don't miss more videos on how to save you time and money. There's also some other videos around the edges of the screen here. If any of those are useful to you, then you can select those now. Thank you for visiting my channel, everyone. I really, really appreciate it.